Yeah, thank you. Thank you, everyone. Uh, my name is Jerry Lee from Panda Green Energy Group, and uh, we are leading uh, investor and operator in the renewable energy sectors. Today, I would like to talk about the uh, Panda Solar Station. Here is the Paris Agreement. I think the Paris Agreement is quite a hot topic this year, especially in the US, because the president is working very hard on the golf course and say, we need to withdraw from the Paris Agreement. I think it is better for him to join Social Good Summit and see what we are talking about and what is happening here. But back to the reality, we can find that after the uh, Paris uh, COP21, there were lots of extreme weathers uh, in the world around the globe. Uh, last week, uh, before my trip to New York, I checked the weather forecast every day because there were two typhoons on the way to Hong Kong. I need to check whether I can make this trip. Here, because uh, we, I think you are quite familiar with the SDGs, uh, for our business, we, we are focused on the renewable sector, so we are quite fit with seven numbers, goals number seven, affordable and clean energy. But we think what we are doing now also fit and covers other aspects of the SDGs. For example, the quality education, because we have the summer camp for, for the youth, and also the industry, innovation, and the infrastructure, and the sustainable city and the communities, climate action, and also the partnership for goals. So I think we, we don't, uh, the agreement, the Paris Agreement is the agreement, but what we need to do is take actions. Everyone should take their own responsibilities and take actions. Everyone is the goalkeeper for the SDG goals. And uh, maybe you will be a little bit curious about why you call your project a panda solar, because, yeah, in reality, we have two giant pandas for the, for the, for the solar panels uh, and the solar farms. And yeah, this is a true project. It's already under operation now in, in China. The capacity is five, uh, 50 megawatts, and uh, which is generating the clean energy to the communities. And this is the first panda solar stations and so the panda solar farms in the world. Our aim is to spread our ideas to the world and let everyone know how to combat with the climate change. Here, uh, the innovation aspect for, the, for this panda solar project is not only focused on the design of the shape of the panda, but also we are a platform for the, for the integration of different technologies and the latest technologies. For example, we use the bifacial modules, which can be can generating the electricity from both sides of the panel. And also we utilize the thin film, thin film technologies, which is from the one of the largest manufacturing in the world, and it is a US company. And we position ourselves as a kind of eco-solution provider. We would like to to let the world and the rest of the world to use the clean energy and affordable clean energy. Uh, we, we hope that to, to, to the year 2030, everyone in the world can use and get the connect, uh, connection to the electricity. Because we found that in some parts of the world, especially the remote areas, there's no grid connections without, uh, there's no electricity. That is our ambitions to let everyone in the world get the affordable and clean energies. Here, uh, I think the Panda Solar project is very interesting because we have so-called Panda Plus collections. We have tailor-made designs for different countries. <laughs> yeah, for example, for Fiji, we have a panda with the Robbie boar. <laughs> we would like to give the life and uh, to make the solar station more meaningful. And also we will have the global presence of our Panda, Panda Solar uh, project. Here I would like to invite Ada, who is the originator of this Panda Solar project. And without, if, without his initiatives, I will not come here to give you the speeches. 
So please welcome Ada. Hi. Hi everyone, thank you Jerry for introducing the solar station for us. My name is Ada Lee and I, this is my fourth year attending high school in the United States um, in Oregon Episcopal School in Portland. Um, and today I'm just going to explain um, my journey as an action taker and my journey of designing the Panda Solar Station with you guys. Um, flashback to 2015, I attended the COP21 conference in Paris. Um, there I made a speech and asked a question to all the leaders sitting um, below the stage. That is, as teenagers, how can we get involved with the process of mitigating climate, um, climate change instead of just seeing government officials sitting in the room dis dis discussing policies? When I went back to my school bringing my knowledge that I learned in the conference, I started developing an idea. That is, why not bring Panda the symbol of peace and love and the, the animal that everybody likes a lot um, together with um, the bulky and Excel-like solar panels. So um, after a year of designing and um, like meetings and stuff, there comes the solar station. <laughs> um, so last summer we initiated um, the Youth Leadership Summer Camp along with UNDP China. And as the commander in chief, I shared my thoughts and my experience with um, the teammates over there. Um, I think the camp is like, I view the camp as a platform to learn from each other and the camp that made me feel extremely optimistic about future climate action leadership. Um, so the reason why I'm here today is simply to share my experience and my work in the past two years and here to tell everyone my age that the future lies in us. And now I want to read a little excerpt from our initiative of advocacy from our summer camp. <clears throat> we hope to live in an environment with blue skies, white clouds, clear river, and green mountain. We, as a young generation, shall bear our own responsibility with thousands of fellows our by our courage, determination, wisdom, and knowledge to protect our homeland. Together, we can make real changes. Thank you. Yeah, this is the building of the summer camp, and also this is the picture of the summer camps. And yes, we have a real giant panda, because we are panda solar, uh, we are panda green. Yeah, now we, I would like to thank our partners from the public and also the private sectors and also the special thank for the UNDP and the UNDP China. Uh, based on their efforts, they make it happen. Uh, now we just uh, one sentence to, to get conclusions. Everyone needs to join us and take the real actions to combat with the climate change. Thank you.